But during the lockdown, we clapped them. And then we laid wreaths for healthcare staff who had died on the front line. And how quickly our nurses have gone from the country's heroes to this government's villains, offered a derisory 72 pence a week pay rise, and then painted as militants for daring, having the audacity for balloting for industrial action. For the first time in a century, Prime Minister, claps don't pay the bills, and neither does 72 pence pay rise. Nurses are leaving the NHS and the droves feeling abandoned by this government. Surely, surely even the Prime Minister agrees that the government has its priorities wrong. When unshackling the bonuses of the bankers and at the same time offering the derisory pay rises to our treasured NHS staff. Well, first of all, can I say what a brilliant job our fantastic nurses do across the country? And you know, the figures he, he's quoting are simply wrong. The independent pay review body recommended a £1,400 rise on average, and that is what the government's committed to delivering. Yeah. Yeah. Natalie Alfie. Yeah. 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 Yeah.